Hello, let me introduce myself. I'm the Crafty Nana. Okay, so I have ironed the fabric and we'll get ready to cover our mattress for our loft bed. This is just some foam that's out of a piece of packaging or a parcel that's come through the post. Um, but it's nice and soft and it will give the impression of a, of a good mattress for our doll. I'm not even sure quite whose bedroom this is going to be yet, so that should be interesting. Tidy up that edge and that's a large label stuck on it. Cover the bottom because that's what you'll see. I didn't cover all that off the top because you're not going to see it. Mm. Liberal amount of hot glue. Mattress gently pressed into place. Soft, oh, very snuggly. Someone's going to sleep well. Very simple way to make bedding. Nice little soft pillow. Very, very simple way to do it. Excuse the football in the background. So all I'm doing is putting hot glue around the edge two sides put the two sides that you've just glued together nice and neatly and press them down firmly to make sure that there are no gaps Turn your pillowcase inside out. Pushing your fingers right into the corners to make sure that you get corners. Here we are, almost there. Make sure there are no gaps in the seams. If there are, you can Always do a little fix on the outside. That's not quite gone into the point. I'd like it to be. There we go. Then take some 
cushion filler. Poke it in. Don't make them too thick if they're going to be bed pillows because bed pillows aren't normally stuffed to the to, until they're full. They should just look nice and soft and comfortable. Tuck the seam in. Oh, it's stuck to me. <laughs> Put the inside seam so it's foldable. Make sure your stuffing's well away from the edge. Put your hot glue along the outside edge. Hold the two edges together. The one I've already done. Then turn it inside out. Pop out the corners. Put in the stuffing. Make sure you're happy that that's enough. They sell big rolls of it that you put in Daiso, so a pound, for a huge amount. You pull this out, this will go on and on and on and on forever because it's um, packed really tight so that we get a lot of stuffing in a very small space. Basically, tuck those edges in. Pull it tight, squeeze it together. A couple of snuggly cushions just to make it comfortable. Probably put uh, something a bit cuter over this once it's done, but got our mattress, got a bit of bedding, got some nice cushions. Oh. Now I've got to build the platform to put the bed on. That's all from me this evening. It's getting late, it's very, very dark, and I'm ready for bed. So I'll catch you next time on The Crafty Nana. Thank you for joining me. I really enjoy your company. Bye.